quite late today, I've just finished having my breakfast. It is half 10, got so many things to do today. I've got to catch up on some work, got to do my laundry, clean my bedroom, meet up with a friend later. So a lot to get done. extremely dirty at the moment. I haven't cleaned it in probably two to three weeks. So I'm gonna clean it now, change the bed sheets, get rid of all of this rubbish, which is on my floor, which has just been accumulating over the past few weeks. So let's clean this. a while to be fair because I had so much stuff in here. I had loads of things on the floor. I had to do my entire wardrobe as well because it was all messy. All of this was all just in a massive pile. Uh, I realised I have a lot of different lunch boxes. I have an absolute stack which I found beneath my bed and in my drawers. I also cleaned up my desk so I can actually work here a bit better. There's no real clutter here anymore. Sorted out my light so I can crack on with my work. So that's bedroom cleaned. What I have to do now is some work. So I've got to catch up on some work that I missed over the week. As I said earlier, I've got quite a lot of work to catch up on. Now I'm a placement student. I go to Loughborough University and I work in private equity. And over the week, there were so many different things, lots of different tasks that came up and it's slightly overrun into my weekend. So I'm going to spend the morning just getting all the work, all the mapping, which I have to get done for Monday morning. Once I've got the mapping done, I will then move on to putting all this work into a PowerPoint deck. Then after that, I can get ready, go to Hyde Park, go on the bikes with my mates and then do a gym session. So I estimate this is probably going to take one and a half, maybe two hours to get done, but then I'll have the whole weekend just to do whatever I want. So let's get cracking on with this now. <sighs> that was a lot longer than I thought it was gonna be, but I managed to get it all done. So all I was doing was looking for as many keywords as possible for my market mapping next week. I've managed to write it all down. I didn't quite get onto the PowerPoint as I wanted, which is a little bit annoying, but it doesn't matter because I can just do that on Monday morning. I'll just wake up quite early. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna have lunch, get the way to the tube station and get all the way over to Hyde Park to meet my friend and go on the Santander bikes. I don't know if you've ever heard of them before, but it's like really cheap, Boris bikes, um, just going around Hyde Park. I don't think I've ever quite seen the tube that busy before. I think there's quite a lot of London tourists at the moment, so the Jubilee line, which I've taken to Green Park, was absolutely rammed. So now I'm currently in Green Park. I'm on my way to Hyde Park to meet my mate. We're gonna go on the Santander bikes and just go around a little bit and see, see what's around. 
then we'll go to the Canary Wharf screens because the tennis open is on at the moment and also the cricket as well. So there's quite a few things to watch today. I don't usually come out in central London because it is so busy on these sorts of days, but uh, I made an exception today. And it's also really nice weather. It's quite warm, a little bit cloudy, but really, really nice weather. So for those of you that don't already know, I am currently a placement student and I go to Loughborough University and I study finance. I'm on a four year course and in that four year course, you have the placement year, which I am currently on. It's a year long in industry, you choose which industry you want to work in. I've chosen private equity. So I've been living in London for the past 11 months now, and I've only got two months left at my job. So I've been living in Canada Water. I obviously from Loughborough, it's quite a big change living in London, but it's a super cool city. There's loads of things which you can do. There's different activities, lots of different restaurants. So you will never really get bored in London at all. Uh, it's such a cool place to live. And usually my weekends will just consist of filming videos and doing these sorts of things. just finished on those Santander cycling bikes. They're quite cool because you've got either the option of choosing an electric bike or choosing just a normal pedal bike. It's cheap as well. It's £1.65 for 30 minutes in comparison to the line bike I took this morning, which was, I think it was a four minute ride and it cost me £2.20. So it's quite an expensive ride, but they're all electric powered. So you can get to about 30 kilometers an hour, which does feel quite fast when you're going around Hyde Park. So now me and my mate are just gonna go grab some food, probably go to Honest Burger, grab some food from there. Been there a couple of times, have some really nice food there. And probably nip down to the Canary Wolf screens later on today. Not too sure yet, we'll see, but really nice day in London. So I literally just came out of Honest Burger and I had what was called a smashed burger. They do something different in every single Honest Burgers apparently. I went to the one in Soho and it was so nice. The food was really good. I had these rosemary fries with, so the burger was just a normal patty, lettuce, onions, and a sort of burger sauce that they make themselves. It was really, really good. I'd definitely recommend it. And it was very cheap, it was £8.50. Plus the service charge, obviously, but very, very cheap. My mate really likes it. So now we're just gonna go off to the screens in Canary Wharf, gonna go to Paddington, get on the Elizabeth line, and quickly watch the tennis for a little bit and then head, out, head back home. up at the Canary Wharf screens. Annoyingly, I managed to miss the tennis and only the cricket was on. I don't really know much about cricket, so I didn't really know what was going on at all. But anyway, I'm in Canary Wharf now. I go to Pure Gym and my membership allows me to go to all different gyms across the country. I usually go to the gym in London Bridge after work, but I'm gonna try out the Canary Wharf Pure Gym right now. See if it's okay, I'll probably do 45 minute to an hour session um, depending on how busy it is and depending on how tired I get because I was at the gym yesterday but I'll try this gym out and see what it's like. gym and went out to get some food so it's quite late now it's currently 9:36, and i think i'm gonna end the vlog here so if you really like the video please like subscribe and comment it really helps and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching